Here's a simple but insightful question regarding bonds and yields. Given two-year bonds have market yield 6%, while one-year bonds have market yield 4%, what's the implied yield for one-year bonds that start one year from now? This problem looks simple, but it actually reflects the basic arbitrage for a principle in swap curve construction and interest rate modeling and calibration. To solve this problem, we look at two investment scenarios. Scenario A is to hold a two-year bond. In this case, the bond will yield 6% per annum for two years. Scenario B is to hold a one-year bond first, which yields 4%. Then hold another one-year bond when the first one expires. For both scenarios, if we start with the initial investment x0, say $1, we make x two year, and they need to make the same amount of profit. Otherwise, it creates an arbitrage opportunity, and one can long one and short the other, and this arbitrage portfolio is guaranteed to make money. Write down the compounding formula for returns for the two scenarios. We can calculate the yield of one year bond one year from now. One plus six percent squared divided by 1 plus 4 percent minus 1, which is about 8 percent. We can in fact estimate it simply by first order estimation, 2 times 6 percent minus 4 percent, which is about 8 percent. Extending this, one can build the entire swap curve with the market rates at different exploits. Okay, hope this is helpful, and thanks for watching.